What's what's like the potential for growth here in the the mining heat reuse space? For the for the residential part, uh, it's uh, it's a huge. Um, you have to imagine that uh, in Europe, thirty percent of energy of all energy is uh, is used for space heating. It's not that common in North America, but uh, in in Europe, you have a lot of uh, homes that have what water based. Uh, uh, radiators. What we what we have here, if uh, one of our earlier prototype, uh, it's uh, it's basically you have a water tank, uh, and be, be beneath you have an evaporator. It's uh, it's uh, it's where you have your ASICs, and uh, it's uh, filled with a fluid. This fluid evaporates uh, when the when uh, the ASICs produces heat, and uh, by evaporating, it goes it goes in, in uh, pipes that goes uh, into the tank, and uh, it con- condensates back. Uh, into a fluid form, liquid form, and uh, it transfer energy uh, doing that. Yeah, so this guy's in production right now. So this is a small unit. Uh, It has 11 kilowatts. Um, Essentially, it's a radial formation with a whole bunch of miners hashing boards kind of around the outside of this wheel. So this one just heats the room. It's It's a very large room. And so it's basically using a fin tube exchanger. On Vancouver Island, this is Shelter Point Distillery. And essentially, they need heat for two aspects. So one is the barrel aging process. So that's about 300 feet long, uh, maybe 10 foot ceilings there. And we're looking to put a sort of immersion style uh, system there. However, it's just basically with a fin tube exchanger heating the air in there. And then we're also looking at putting a direct heat injection into their mash process with a uh, large tank that will be sort of the battery um, of the system. And we're still ironing out some of the details of a potential whiskey release, uh, Bitcoin whiskey. Um, So we are are fired up about that, targeting the next uh, halving for that. So highly optimistic. And I think that's that's a really fun and exciting use for for Bitcoin energy. And I think a lot of Bitcoin people enjoy uh, Scotch style whiskey as well, so. 